We're so pleased to be here today with our 8th Annual Heritage Day and our historic costume characters who are all residents of Saratoga. Uh, we will now hear who each character is at this point. Speak loud. So I'm William Campbell. Uh, we started a, I started a sawmill up the valley here uh, in about 1867 and produced a lot of the lumber that you still see in some of these very old buildings here. Hello, I'm Hannah McCarty. I'm the wife of Martin McCarty, the founder of McCarthyville and Saratoga, and one of the first entrepreneurs in the area. I'm the one and only Martin McCarty, and I established the uh, little town of Saratoga, the village, and made a lot of money, and then I died, and I gave it to Hannah. <laughs> and she spent it. <laughs> Good afternoon. My name is Charles uh, McClay. I came to California in 1851, uh, soon after to Saratoga as a Methodist minister. But then I discovered business and politics. I eventually became a state senator and uh, had several businesses in Saratoga, one of which was the big mill at, the, uh, at Highway 9, uh, near where today the Hoconee driveway is. Hello, I'm Martha McWilliams. I'm married to James McWilliams, Saratoga's second blacksmith, and I came to Saratoga in 1864. And please come over to the museum and visit my 1850s Pioneer Cottage. Thank you. I'm Julia Morgan, and I was born in the 18, late 1800s. 1904, I became the first woman uh, architect, and uh, uh, later I built 700 homes during my uh, my lifetime and uh, you can see one of the first buildings I built the Foothill Club which is just next to the Federated Church which I also built part of thank you my name is Sarah Brown I'm the daughter of John Brown the famous abolitionist who led the raid on Harper's Ferry and began the Civil War. I came to Saratoga in 1868. I'm Sam Cloud. Uh, I had a, a grocery store at 1501 Big Basin Way. Uh, I started the store, I bought the store in 1893. I prospered and in 1896 I built the small Victorian house next to it which is now the uh, Bella Saratoga. Uh, in 1907 I came out of the store and stepped in front of a trolley and uh, was hit and uh, died shortly thereafter in the Bella Saratoga. I am Mary Brown, wife of the famous and infamous slightly John Brown the abolitionist that helped trigger the Civil War. And she came out about 11 years after he was hanged with a couple of her children and grandchildren and came to Red Bluff. They built a house for her by subscription and then the, about 11 years later they moved here to Saratoga up on Bowman Road to a little orchard. How many minutes are we given? That's enough? <laughs> and she lived here and died in San Francisco and her famous daughter Sarah lived after they're all buried not John all the rest of them are buried in Madronia up Oak Street you can go visit it's beautiful is that enough thanks my name is Theodore Vors I am Hungarian I had a studio where the current bell tower is and I was there until 1939 when I died I was well known and my my work is in the Smithsonian in the White House and in the local Triton Museum have 30 of my works I was in Japan I painted in Japan and when I came to this valley and saw the trees and the blossoms I said this is home I'm Mrs. Aki uh, my son is not here today but uh, he's, a big hero. he's a big hero of the World War II, if I was, sorry. <laughs> Thank you. Here, sunshine. 
I'm uh, Pastor Edwin Sidney Williams, also known as also known as Everlasting Sunshine. I uh, back in 1899, we were having a drought just like today, and uh, the, the rains came in the spring, so the blossoms came out, and uh, we were very thankful. So we uh, began a festival in town called the Blossom Festival that lasted for 40 years. Hello, I am James Phelan, former mayor of San Francisco and representing California in the U.S. Senate. I was California's first popularly elected senator. I built my country estate here in beautiful Saratoga called Villa Montavo, which I later deeded to uh, the state upon my death. I'm Mrs. Charles Blaney. At the turn of the century, many rich residents from San Francisco began to come to Saratoga. My husband and I came in 1906 and we built Bella Vista Mansion. It was after we built our mansion that James Phelan built his. It was, ours was an inspiration built and designed by Willis Polk. I personally was a lifelong suffragette and helped campaign to get women's votes for the United States. Hi, I'm Isabella Stein. My husband Oscar and I built, bought property up the hill here. And in 1917, I visited Japan. And while I was there, I visited Fuji Hakone and named my new estate after Hakone. And then I also created the moon garden, moon viewing house that's currently at Hakone. My name was Edgar Parker, but to keep truth in advertising, it was legally changed to Painless Parker. I live in a very large house on 200 acres in the foothills of Saratoga. This is all brought to me through my dental practice. At one juncture in my career, I used to extract teeth on the, from the, on the back of a wagon and the fee was 50 cents a tooth. As an anesthetic, I used a solution of whiskey and cocaine. San Francisco was very good to me. Ultimately, I wound up a multimillionaire and owned 30 dental outlets. I was also a pariah to the local dental association, but I always championed oral hygiene, access to dentistry for the common man, and of course, advertising. Thank you. I'm a bit older, my dear. <laughs> I am Olivia de Havilland, the renowned actress. I still live in Paris, although I'm quite old right now. I received two Academy Awards <clears throat> and was nominated many times for uh, various roles that I did. My most famous role, of course, was... Um, <laughs> Gone with the Wind, and where I played L Melanie. And here is my sister. That was supporting actress, by the way. But still. My name is Joan Fontaine. I went to Sarah, uh, excuse me. Yes, I did. I went. Don't correct me. <laughs> I went to Saratoga. I went to Saratoga Elementary. I was born in Tokyo. I have a one year and three month older sister, Lovely. who mommy always liked best. Yes. However, I won an Academy Award for my role for best actress in Rebecca. 
And out of modesty, I did not bring it today. <laughs> I attribute my fabulous beauty to being raised in this heaven on earth called Saratoga. I thank you. We are nurses from Villa Fatima. We are happy to keep you happy and healthy, and we represent the oldest business in Saratoga since 1948. We're happy to do enemas after. <laughs> Hi, I'm Mrs. Hatakayama. I'm one of the six fam Japanese families who lived in Saratoga during World War II. After the Pearl Harbor incidents, we were sent to the internment camp in Wyoming. And now I was allowed to come back and to, to where Sar my hometown is, and that is Saratoga. I'm Paul Masson, and I started here in the valley making uh, some fine wines and later champagnes, which apparently they won't let me call that anymore. Uh, but I fell in love with Saratoga and moved up the hill, and we'll sell no wine before it's time. I'm Dr. Burton Brazil, and I'm not a doctor from the standpoint of being a physician, but I'm a professor at San Jose State University. I teach political science. And it's apropos that I did teach that because I became the very first mayor in Saratoga when we were incorporated in 1956. And I'm Florence Cunningham. I never married because I was so devoted to Saratoga. I collected everything I could and helped found the History Museum with all my artifacts and that I had taken. And then I wrote a book called The History of Saratoga, which I'm very proud of. And unfortunately, I couldn't find it this morning when I was... <laughs> But uh, thank you for coming and celebrating our history, and we're so glad you all were here. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Lawrence. Okay.